So we'll see if this actually gets up and posts anywhere, but I've decided to maybe vlog my reading. Um, also don't mind my hair. <laughs> it's a little bit crazy right now. So uh, I actually started The Child Thief last night. I only read like 30 pages though because I started feeling sick and so I had to put it down. It's pretty good so far, like 30 pages in. I'm really intrigued to see where it goes. some point today. I needed to get up and just make myself a cup of tea. I literally did not make it far. I think I read a couple pages, but I'm making myself some black tea and my French press. I wish you guys could smell that. That smells incredible. One thing that distracted me from reading, which I thought was just gonna like be really cute and in the background, was these things called uh, ecospheres. Some girl that I watched on YouTube was talking about it and I was like, no, it's an ecosphere. And I got sucked in. So what was going to be just a background noise type thing ended up taking up a lot of my time. <laughs> They're actually really cool and I am super invested and want to make one now. My hair is just this is not, I need to do my hair and my hair is naturally curly and it's just so fried that this is what happened. It's really cute, I really like it. Also my slanted candles. That's basically my house. It's just kind of cute, but also slanted, so. I think I'm going to try to read some more. It's not like I don't like it. I do like it. I don't want to blame the book, but maybe it has something to do with the book. I don't know. It's definitely not a genre I typically read. Like I'm not full fantasy. I guess it's not full fantasy, but it kind of is. Um, so it's just hard for me. Like magical realism is super hard for me to understand and grasp and, cause like one second I'm like, wait, What's going on? So I just think my brain isn't big enough to understand. Like when I was reading Exit West uh, two years ago, it confused me because I, going into it, had no idea that there was magical, uh, magical realism in it. And so as I was reading it, I literally had to like reread so many things because I just wasn't understanding it. Okay, I'm gonna go read now. I'm going to enjoy my tea and I'm going to listen to some pretty music with um, a video of the woods. Hello, it's me again. You're in my closet now, specifically in one of my cubbies. I changed again, I told you I would. Um, I read a little bit more. So I started on page 30, finished at page 50. Sometimes you don't have a good day with reading and that's okay. That's fine. I needed to get ready um, because we're going to a friend's house for dinner. Yeah, I don't tend to do well reading at home. I've always been like this. Well, I guess not always. In high school, I was better about it. In high school, I would just sit in my bed and read the entire time. And now I can't do that. Especially as of late, um, has just felt kind of like wrong for sitting at home and just reading. I don't have a like nine to five job right now. And so it's just, it feels weird and it feels wrong. Like while my husband's out working and I'm just sitting at home reading or watching YouTube or doing like it just feels like I should be doing something else and so I don't know but I have to like tell myself like it's okay like he's never made me feel like 
wrong for any of that. It's just a me thing and like I have to tell myself like that's okay. Like in this season right now. For some reason, I have a lot of time on my hands and that's okay. Like I probably will never get this again and so I need to like take advantage of it and I keep telling myself that and I really don't know how to like vlog. I've never done this before. I what do I talk about? What do I say? What do I bitch on about the book, you know? But I'm really hoping to get some reading done tonight when I get home. I just in bed. Um, it's hard. Oh, that's another thing too. It's hard for me to read in bed at night because my husband, as soon as he his head hits the pillow, clocks out, and we need to get like lamps. I need to get a reading light. I don't have one currently, and so he's like asleep and I have to turn the light on then I feel bad and so then I just turn the light off and then go to bed. I do my makeup like an e-girl. I put a lot of blush on my cheeks and then on my nose. I didn't even know that that's what e-girls did until I saw like a video about it and I was like oh I do that. Is that what it is e-girl? Or was it a soft girl? Dude I don't even know. I asked my sister if she was like an e-girl or a soft girl and she was so mad at me that I knew what that was. My sister is just turned 17 and I am turning 23 next month. Um, and apparently like she, I just am not allowed to know any of that, I guess. I think she thinks I'm much older than I am, which like, I, she knows how old I am, but like we live in two separate worlds or something. I'm like, come on, I'm, I'm with the times. I'm on the internet. I do my makeup in like this low light which is really really dangerous because it could look one way right now and look completely different um when i walk into the actual lighting i'm all about risk taking risk taking one so do my highlighter or highlight <laughs> like a knee girl as well. I'm so glad that the shiny look is in because I've always been super shiny because my skin is super oily and so now whenever my skin like greases up it's just fashion. Excuse me. Oh, my dog is just like sitting right on the ground. Also my bathroom is a mess. I li my stomach hurts so much after that. <laughs> is that even... Didn't even do a good job. This video is so long and I did not intend it to be this long. I need to redo my bangs. Because I had them clipped for so long. So now they're... <laughs> That's embarrassing. Anyway, I'm gonna go fix my bangs and then wait for my husband to come home. And... Then go to dinner and... If I read tonight, I will record it. If not, then I will see you tomorrow. Hello. It is the next day, um, Thursday. And I got home pretty late last night, so I didn't read. And I also didn't read today. It's only 4 p.m., so I'm hoping to get some reading in. Um, at some point, I need to finish this book before tomorrow night. And I don't know. I don't know if that's going to happen. I was also supposed to get some work done today. Didn't do that as well. So it's just been really, I don't know. Today was kind of weird. So I just wanted to check in and say that I think I might get some work done and then try to read a little bit. But me and Charles are ordering pizza and having a movie night tonight. So I'm not going to like, like if I get to it, I get to it. If I don't, I don't. And that's what's happening. Hello, so book club was canceled. So I'm not finishing it today. Um, and honestly, I probably won't pick it up until we've established a new book club day because I'm don't know if I'm loving it. It's not a bad book. I read, which I didn't film unfortunately, um, I read an extra 50 pages 
or not an extra but I read another 50 pages so I'm about like a hundred and something pages in um and I don't I'm still not invested in the story I it's don't get me wrong it's a good read like it's a good book like that is not even in question it for me personally it's not my it's not what I would pick up normally so um I just really hard for me to get invested in and if I don't have to read it then I wouldn't um so I think I'm gonna take time to read some of the books that I do want I want to finish the woman in the window and so I am gonna put the child thief down and read that and hopefully finish that but yeah this is kind of like an uneventful vlog and I am sorry for that but hey at least at least we are here right at least this is happening. What? I don't know. I I don't know. So I was actually gonna pull out my camera to record an outro, but I don't feel like it. Just this entire vlog, whatever, has been filmed on my phone. Uh, which I mean, at this point, I feel like you know, phone quality is almost as good. Right. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it wasn't very eventful and it wasn't, um, there wasn't that much talk about books, unfortunately, but I am trying to be better at being active with my YouTube channel, um, while I read and I figured I would try to take you along as I read and I'm getting a bunch of texts and I don't know if that's coming through. I hope not. I'm trying, I really enjoy making videos and I really enjoy reading. And so I don't know why, I don't know why it's a challenge to bring them both together. Let me know what kind of video you go. <laughs> Let me know what kind of videos you guys like. Do you like vlog style videos? Would you rather me sit down and just review a book after I've done, um, after I'm done reading it? Do you like, um, Calls. <laughs> what do you, what do you want to see from me? I didn't mean to rhyme. Anyway, I hope you guys like this video. Um, I'm going to link down all my socials if you want to follow me on Instagram and keep up with my books that way. Um, but yeah, I will see you in the next one.